Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Doctor Who the Adventure Games. My name is Crowmore and today we'll be facing off with everyone's favorite flesh-eating shadows in episode 4, Shadows of the Vashta Nerada. Let's just jump right in and see what the what is what. It's coming at us again! That glass won't take much more punishment. It isn't there anymore, which means we can't get back to the TARDIS. Okay, so we are underwater with a killer mutant shark thingy that eats uh, metal structures, and there are also going to be some shadow monsters lurking around. So that is quite a pickle, I might say. Oh my god, yes! We haven't seen much of Washta Nerada in the series. I would like to see more of them. But this will do. This will do just fine. So what is this place? Subaquatic community. Isn't it amazing? When the oceans rose, 75% of Earth's landmass drowned. Humanity built its own new islands and moved on to the ocean bottom to farm and mine for minerals. You're a resourceful lot, you humans. That's why I love you. You're moving anywhere, a bit like hermit crabs. Crabs? Yeah, thanks a lot. Poseidon 8, that's the closest. Come on, be rude not to say hello. All right, we know the controls. Uh, the game wants me to go this way. So should we just immediately do something else and go here? And see if we can find any loot. What? No loot whatsoever. I am disappointed in you, game. Okay, let's go here. And let's see if we can find any any people. Well, we found the shark. Okay. Does that mean that we need to run? Oh. Uh, when you get close to something of interest, yeah, 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 yeah. Am I close to something of interest? Maybe that? No? Why did you say that to me, game? Oh god, damn it. <laughs> that didn't glow. And the Sonic does what the Sonic does and what? To open the door, you must repeat the code shown on the keypad. Some doors have longer code sequences, making them harder to open. Okay, new kind of puzzle. 998. Ooh! I'm a genius. Okay. Hint! We don't need no hints. Should we go here? No, we should not. So this is quite a complex, this one. Uh, sector 8... Sector 8? What the hell am I talking about? That no 8. Uh, sector F or Sector E? Let's go with F. If we can. We can. Awesome. And what is your problem, shark? Like, why do you keep doing that? Unhappy with something? Not enough tuna for you. One, five, one. Oh my god, these are so easy. In before, there's like a 50 number sequence. Huh? Nothing? Really? Not even a collectible? What is this madness? And uh, the game hasn't told me yet, but I think we should try to stay away from the shadows. Because we know that there's some Vashta Nerada somewhere around here. Why, shark? Why? S 
six, one, five, four. Noise. Is there anyone left alive? That is the thing that I want to know. Fact. World fact, water pressure. The further you go underwater, the greater the pressure, due to the weight and density of water. Even at shallow depths, the water pressure can compress the air in your lungs, ears and sinuses, causing pain and possible damage to your eardrums. At the bottom of the ocean, the pressure is so great, an unprotected human would be squashed to the size of a football. Deep sea diving craft must be incredibly strong to withstand this kind of pressure. Great. Absolutely fantastic. I hate the sea. Or... I can't say I hate the sea. Ooh, there's a collectible. Let me just... Yeah, I know what they are, goddammit. We found a strawberry. Yeah. So, sea is all nice and good. When you look at it. But you don't want to be in the sea. Just imagine it, like... Fucking... Multiple kilometers just water and all kinds of... Eyeless monsters lurking beneath the waves. I have read my oh, two, four, seven, two. I have read my lo Lovecraft, so I know that people should not be, not be deep, deep beneath the waves. Wait a minute, I am now disoriented, and I cannot go here. So that helps. So we can go. He Wait a minute. Sector D. Okay. And did, did the doctor say that Sector Omega was the one that we wanted to be? Or something? Oh my god, I need to pay more attention. So this is Sector C. Let's see. <coughs> oh my god, excuse me. Sector B and Sector B. And there's Sector... A, maybe? Let's see if we can go here. What's that? Some sort of retinal scanner. Can we go here? It looks like we can. 73574. 73574. I'm glad that I always get that uh, success music when we do that <laughs> mundane task. It's great. Uh, sector A. Can we go here? Oh, I see a collectible. Wilfred Mott. Oh my god, Wilfred is awesome. And he's also Donna's granddad. Newspaper seller, amateur astronomer and alien conspiracy theorist. He's not allowed to have a webcam though. Oh my god, one of the best characters. Hey. What's this? Fact. Underwater vegetation. Sea sprouts are rich in iron and can be used in medicine or as food. Iron helps uh, our blood to carry oxygen around the body. Sticky mushrooms grow in dark, damp areas, as do most types of mushrooms. Many contain lots of vitamins and minerals, but some are poisonous. Brine oil is organic sea ooze that contains high levels of, uh, of iodine and can be used to maintain the underwater machinery. All right, let's go on a mushroom trip. If we can't find anything else to do around here. Hey, did you glow? No. Only Amy glows. Amy is the bright star that guides us. I am confused. So have we been here? Poseidon 8? Okay. Let's try to go there. Four, one, three, four, two. Four, one, three. Oh my god. Four, two? Yes! Okay. So I'm guessing that because this place looks different than all the rest, so this must be where we want to go. Yes! Any survivors? What is that thing? It's not like any shark I ever saw. Of course not. It's not a shark, and it's not from Earth. Quick, inside! Yeah, survivors! The Doctor, Amy, 
You? Martin Flanagan. Doctor? Then there's a hospital ship up top. You came down in a bathosphere? Is that like some newfangled 23rd century coroner bath? Only no coroners. She's still getting used to the pressure. Oswald must have gotten SOS out. Maybe Jones will let me into Poseidon. Now there's medical help. Who needs medical help? The sickness. It's taken everyone on the base. Oswald has put the place on lockdown. That's why Jones won't let me in. I was working a harvester out on the prairie. That creature attacked us. Killed Pat, the base leader. I'm the only survivor. And then Jones wouldn't let me in. Because of the quarantine. The creature had knocked out communications. I've been stuck here two days. What kind of idiot is this, Jones? It's a computer. Aha! So let's talk to the computer. Hello, Jones. I'm the doctor. Now, what's all this about you not letting in my good friend? Uh, Martin. My good friend, Martin. Uh, let us in. Let us in, Jones. There's a good computer. The Sidon community is on lockdown. Quarantine must be maintained to safeguard the staff on Poseidon. Uh, what about your directive? But you're not safeguarding the staff, are you? What do you mean? Martin's not safe. He'll starve to death. I'm a doctor. I can cure everyone in that base. If you keep me out here, they'll all die. And I bet you're fitted with standard Nexus Prime laws. See, you can't injure a human being or, through inaction, allow a human being to come to harm. The Poseidon community is on lockdown. I cannot open this door. Uh, how about a compromise? How about a compromise? If you release the manual override, then we will open the door, not you. And I wouldn't have to actually open the door myself? Nope, you won't be in breach of your programming. Scout's on it. Uh, let us in. How about it? Does that work for you? It's an acceptable, logical solution. Releasing manual override now. now. Ah, stupid computer. Doctor did quite a whirl there while he was running. Open sesame. Ah, thanks for your help, Jones. It's been a relief to talk to someone who understands me, Doctor. Oh, boy. I think you've pulled. Well, I, I can see the attraction. Oswald! Dana! Martin! We thought you'd been killed. Merry Christmas for what it's worth. When you put Poseidon into quarantine, Jones wouldn't let Martin through. But that's going to happen if you have a Cyber Class 14 system with a Nexus Prime processor doing the work of, well, a 1984 PC. Like putting Einstein on a supermarket checkout. Gonna get grumpy and play out. Who are you? He's a doctor. There's a hospital ship up top. But there isn't any hospital ship. You don't need a hospital ship. You've got me. You can wish for a better Christmas present. <clears throat> and I'm Amy. Just Amy. You're not looking too good, Ozzy. Get away from me. He's just trying to help. Bingo. Well observed. Who are you? Dana Tanaka. I'm the Poseidon medic. The sickness kills off the red blood cells. It doesn't respond to anything. We've confined non-essential crew to their quarters. If he's not from the hospital ship, where did he come from? There's too much weird stuff going on around here. It's the lights! But well, what are you scared of? It's not just a sickness, is it? They hide in the shadows. They come in the dark. What does? Oh, shit. Ashton Arana. Martin! What? What happened to him? Carnivorous photo organisms that live in the dark, like schools and piranha fish swimming in the shadows. I am never turning the lights off again. Not ever. The vast and Narada on Earth are usually timid and feed on roadkill. But this, down here, this is something else. This is alien. It started with the flash. Flash? What flash? Two days ago. Lit up the ocean bed. The sickness, that creature, the shadows, it all started then. I have to evacuate this base. Good plan, bad idea. Life pods, lots of dark corners. Your people will be dead before they reach the surface. We're on emergency lighting. It won't last much longer. I've got to get everybody off Poseidon. Or I fix a generator. Come on, Amy. You two, stay out of the shadows and forget about the life pods. How do you stay out of the shadows when there's, like, no light whatsoever? Get to the generator room. All right. Can we fiddle with any of this? 
We can talk to the computer. What? We can get to the generator through these blue doors, but this corridor is now too dark to safely pass. I'm going to have to boost the lighting somehow. Somehow? Uh, maybe with the... Uh, maybe we can talk to, to the computer or we can use Sonic on this. I think I'm going to need something with the power to charge this light panel. Oh, could it be Sonic screwdriver? Oh yeah. Charge the lights. The lights require charging, uh, powering up. Press the power button the moment the spinning indicators align with the green blocks. If you attempt to power up, when the indicators are aligned with the red blocks, you will short circuit the power system. The what now? Oh. Okay, great. Woohoo. I did not read, uh, what that said. Hopefully. Oh my god. <laughs> I died. So yeah, let's not go there. Actually, we can go there. Just need to power this baby up. Where did... I need to go to the generator room, but I don't know where that is. Uh, boom. What? Oh, I need to press this. Boom. Oh, Amy is just beelining it. Oh no. Oh yeah, we really need to be fast. Okay, generator room. Where are you? Oh my god, I have to do this with every single corridor. And... Oh! Run! Okay, Amy seems to know where she's going. So let's just follow her. Oh, this is dark as heck. So let's not go in there. And... Okay. Let's go here. What is this? The game decided to do something stupid. Okay, now it works again. <laughs> no idea what happened there. And boom! Oh god damn it. And boom! Run! Uh, doctor takes a bit of time before he gets on to the full speed. Uh, ah! me oh my god! No! I didn't realize that it was dark. Okay, so... Did I come from... What? Where did I come from? Oh my god. Uh, okay, let's... Let's uh, fiddle with this thing. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And... Oh yeah, this one. Uh, boom. God damn it. Boom! And run! What? So that was not the correct corridor. <laughs> what the fuck? Jesus Christ. Okay, so if I fiddle with this, does that light up that corridor? Maybe? Jesus Christ. Okay. Pump up the power! Oh my. There we go. Yep. Okay, so this was the correct. Correct way. Generator. Cause here at last, good old Jones is open the airlock to the generator. Yeah, let's go there. Hey. Are we just going to instantly die? No, for some reason, okay. Got a quid for the meter. I can do better than that. Let there be light. You should have done right that then. before you entered. Work. Doctor, what about the TARDIS? She'll be alright, that part of the tunnel was sealed off. Yes, but there's still a ton of ocean in between us and it. Yeah, we'll cross that bridge. Or flooded tunnel when we come to it. Oh! Hello, sailor. Doctor, it's alive. The Vash and Narada are animating it. Oh my god, there's another one. Don't let it touch you. Don't let any of them touch you. At least they are 
fairly slow. And can we just use uh, use our Sonic on them? We should be safer up here. Uh, so from where can we start up the generator? Ah. Oh no. Move, Amy. Ah, now if only I could get the divers into that alcove. So that was a tip. Uh, actually, what did... What the hell did this do even? I need to get the divers into that alcove. Uh, can I send Amy? Oh my... If the light gets rid of the Vashta, would it work on those divers? Uh, what? Get them to walk into the light. I bet that'll sort them out. Walk into the light. They are in the light. What light? Do I need to like... Uh, kite them around or something? Stealth. Uh, I am a bit confused on what I should be doing. Let's see if the game is willing to tell me. Rewire the generator console. Oh, defeat the first and second dri uh, driver. <laughs> Diver. But what light? That's a fact. Nuclear power. Nuclear power uses controlled nuclear reactions or nuclear fission to heat water into steam, which can be used to generate electricity. There are many benefits to nuclear power, but sometimes serious ac accidents can occur. The used nuclear fuel is extremely dangerous and must be disposed of carefully. Many ships and submarines now use nuclear power, as do some spacecraft. Great. So what the f... I don't... W okay. Do I need to like block their... Block their way maybe? It seems. So they have to go around. Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ. What the hell. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Run 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 run. Okay, and now the block is there. So how is that going to help us? So if we now use this, something should happen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was a, a bit of an anticlimactic, but yeah, let's just wait for the other guy to come. <laughs> Come around and we can turn on the lights. <laughs> oh no. Boop. There we go. And now what? Are they dead? They were already dead. The Vashin Rada just hadn't done with them yet. Hello. Environment status chip indicates dangerous radiation. And it's been activated. Radiation? This is turning into such a great place. But shouldn't we get this generator working before the lights go out and the Vashtas hear the dinner bell? Good point. Come on. Yeah, okay. So where is the console that we need to fiddle with? Oh. This one. Ah, rewiring. We know this chat. Uh, yellow. Okay, it's pretty far. Let's see. So this... We can most likely do like that. Then the blue needs to go from here. So that leaves a uh, little room for yellow. Ah, move! Why? 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 Wait! 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 What the hell? It didn't want to move. Oh my god! Huh, huh. There. And uh, then we want to do the green, and we do the red like that, and take the yellow from here. Oh my god! Beautiful. Hmm. Generator's still not working properly. 
Must be something blocking the vents. I'll keep working on it here. You head up the corridor and... I know, I know. Bravely face the darkness and monsters and save the day again. Well, it's probably just a matter of flicking a switch, actually. But, yes. Good luck with, uh... Flicking that switch. Flush the generator vent. Okay, Amy. Let's go flick the switch. I don't know. Actually, can we... Oh, great. Not much of an imp improvement. The lights are going crazy now. Okay. So stay on the bright bits. Uh, huh. Huh. Okay, okay, okay. Is this even the correct way? Yeah, seems so. Okay. Oh! Run! We did it. There was some panel there. Is it something that we need to use? No, it's not. It's the door panel. Uh, this looks like a place that could have a switch. <laughs> so there's just this switch here, randomly. Okay, let's flick it. We did it. That sounds better. Hopefully that generator will spring to life now. Hopefully. Okay, I think this is a great time to end this episode. Right here, we flicked the switch, we powered up the generator and we need to get back to the doctor and see what the hell can we do next. But we are going to leave that to the next episode. Thanks for joining once again and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.